My name is Ade Inka I write for the Guardian newspapers in Lagos. My name is Ade Inka Ade I write for the Guardian newspapers in Lagos. Alright, sir. What's your take on the whole event? I think uh, it's been a fun-filled, exciting, you know, breathtaking one week of table tennis action. And I must commend uh, the church for putting this together. Uh, it's the only national championship that we have right now in table tennis. And they have done well to ensure that it is growing from year to year. The first year to 50,000 Naira prize money. But today we witnessed winners going on with as much as 2, two million Naira. I mean, that is, that is aside the, the, the amount used in putting the event together. For me, the Christ Embassy Church have done well and they need to be commended. Also from the point of uh, uh, the playing personnel, I mean the players, they have shown that there is future for table tennis if people come in to invest and sponsor. You know, look at the girl that played the uh, uh, Fatima. Fatima who played uh, in the finals today. She came here to play in the junior category but opted for the seniors. I mean, to everyone's surprise, she defeated Cecilia Otu, who is on the national team, defeated Jennifer Friday, who is the division champion. And what does this point to? It points to the fact that champions are emerging from this competition. And if you have one or two more like this, we can be sure that the future of table tennis is secured in the country. Also, from the officiating point of view, officials who are going to, I mean, represent us at the international competitions will also have local commissions to test their ideas before going to the uh, world stage. And for me, that is a beautiful one. Yeah. Uh, like I said earlier, you know, Christ Embassy, you know, under the guidance of Pastor Chris.